Give it a moment. <laughs> Good morning, good afternoon. <laughs> it's Carla of Rayhan's World and GiggleFest University. And I am here to speak with you in English for people between 8 and 20 only. I am so lucky today. I, only, I don't only have Noor here to assist me. But I have two of Pakistan's super kids here to speak with you and inspire you. I have Abdullah Samim and Muhammad Samid, and I am so excited to have them here. And I, Samid, smile. Don't take it so seriously. Have fun. And Lord, you know what you need to do while I share out. Can you get to work, please? And I am going to begin sharing out. Nor. Okay, I'll, uh, I'm on it. Okay, you got to begin talking if you're on it. Oh, uh, I mean, addressing someone to bring her in. So I was doing that. Assalamu alaikum, guys. This is Nurullah from Saudi Arabia, and I'm here to improve my English and assist Kanda as a co host. Uh, today's show is a youth show, and there is an age limit of from eight years to 20 years. If you are adult, please don't try to join it. Even please don't, don't join today's show because it's not for you. It's specific for the future of the society, for the future of Pakistan, and for the future of leadership. Because every super kid and every kid is a leader. Uh, we have a few simple rules. Uh, rule number one, turn on your camera and it just on your beautiful face that we can see you clearly. Rule number two is do not unmute yourself. Mm -hmm. uh, but today the youth, so I know it's going to be better because they don't touch anything like that. So uh, I'm happy about They're that. Wonderful! The youth yeah. are so better behaved than the adults. It's unbelievable. Yeah, that's I, true. I would love to have the youth here every day, so you can come. But today is for you between eight and twenty. And let me do what I need to do. So I'll be quiet. Yeah, and. Um, it's not about the kids because they are, uh, you know, energetic. I know that. But if you come in, in the show, uh, wear a casual dress, uh, shalwar kameez, whatever traditions you are following around the world. So that showing uh, who you are, you know, is, is like you can, you, you are looking like beautiful. So we have Abdullah and we have Muhammad Samid. Um, so you know, uh, next time Abdullah should be open a show because he's become a co-host of the show for the for the youth show. So we will train him for opening the show as well. Yeah, that uh, will happen. I'm excited. And that will happen. Um, Samid will be added to that group. But we yeah. get Samid to relax and smile and laugh more before I'll do that. Okay, Samid. <laughs> I better get that. And guys, uh, I'm not sure what going to be talking about uh, because I was getting late to eat my dinner and we did not decided any topic, but Carla will suggest later. So I let's go. It's, it's a little different. I let the kids kind of bring that together. Okay. So, um, I do have some ideas, but introduce them and let's get it started let me involve myself with them and you finish your job and then come back so then we will talk okay uh, abdullah over to you introduce yourself yes my introduction is that i'm a young motivational speaker i'm 14 years old and i'm in ninth class i'm a young entrepreneur i'm running my own business and moreover i'm also a host of a program <clears throat> 
I'm running a leader in me course. I'm the head of that course. I'm, I'm the head of that course and I'm Super Kid Pakistan 4 from the University of Spoken English. And I'm a co-host of your show as well from now onwards. Alhamdulillah, I'm blessed to be a co-host. And I'm working with the Torch organization. I'm the ambassador of the Torch organization, technology ambassador. I'm working with many schools and organizations like SOS Village and the school of, uh, in Balochistan, Chaman. And this is my intro and inshallah, I will work on English for the people as well. Before we go further, could you explain to people why English is so very important for yes. especially the youth to learn? I want your opinion on that. And then we'll go further. Yes, my opinion on this is that because English is nowadays, English is becoming a large and a vast field. Because if you are a teacher of English and if you are if you want to discuss, I feel like I'm discussing with you. And if I don't know how to speak in English, I cannot seek knowledge from you. I cannot be a co-host in this show. So English is very important to become a great personality. Because in Pakistan, there are almost 22 crore people. And if I want to be famous, in uh, I can speak Urdu. And I have an opportunity. I have a love from 22 crore people. But I want love from all over the world. So I should know how to speak in English. So they can understand what I am saying and they can respond to me as well. Excellent. Thank you. I love that answer. Okay, let's go to Samid. I know I'm talking more than I should. Um, I'm getting... Focused. Okay, and I'm happy you are talking, you know. Yeah, but it takes longer for me to do what I need to do when I'm talking. Yeah. <laughs> it's not my problem, Kala. And Abdullah, you need to attend the room as well. Uh, you can, you need to see that. So there is somebody. Okay, I'm watching. Okay, Muhammad Samid, introduce yourself. My name is Muhammad Samid. Uh, I'm six years old. Uh, in 2019, 12 January, I'll become seven years old. I'm studying, you know, just spoken English and computer science. Um, uh, I go to the, you know, just spoken English and computer science to, to learn the English. Great. So, I belong to uh, the Okay, that's great. Uh, Shoei Bakhter, you need to adjust your camera at your face. You know, it's the rule of the show. Uh, as far as you know, you joined it before. I recognize you, so that will be better. Um, Samir, what what is you doing uh, apart from study? Uh, like, tell us about a little bit about yourself. Uh, I like football. Um, my my favorite uh, book is Quran Majid. Um, uh, I uh, I read uh, uh, a part of uh, a full part of Quran and I'm in sixteen pa a para of Quran. I want to say that this six-year-old told me yesterday that he can recite the Quran. Mm -hmm. I don't know what you're doing, Noor, but I need you here. <laughs> uh, Carla, somebody want to join the, uh, you know, the show, and I am teaching uh, how to join the show, so that's uh, a bit conflict. Okay. Um, yeah. Please bear with me for that. I'm bearing with you, like always. Uh, <laughs> Yeah. So, Samid, tell us a little more about how long did it take you to learn to do, to recite the Quran? Because Man. I'm amazed that you can do that. It's just, it blows my mind. You know what I mean when I say that? Yes, Kala, Auntie, and Inshallah, in three months, uh, I will again finish uh, the uh, part of Quran. And guys, I'm coming, uh, coming to our room to teach the Quran to us. Who, 
do you know that I read the Quran every Monday and Thursday night online? For you, it would be Tuesday and Friday morning. Okay. And we read it in English. May, 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 uh, Auntie, may I tell you in the Maharaj of Alif how we can pronounce the Alif? Yeah, tell me. There will be upper teeth and, and down teeth. Uh, uh, sorry, and down, down lips. When upper uh, teeth uh, da um, go down, so it will uh, touch to our lips. Uh, it will go under the lips and uh, uh, the air which is remaining in our mouth, so we can pronounce the alif. alif. What is the alif? I have no idea what that is. Mem first uh, letter of Arabic. It is written in Nurani Kaida. Okay. Can someone help me understand that a little more? Can you tell me a little more, Samit? I used to speak Hebrew, and I spoke Hebrew pretty fluently, but we're not talking about Hebrew here. Kalanti, uh, I do not understand your question. Can someone help me help him understand it? Kala, repeat the question and I will make him understand. You'll make him understand. Wonderful. I don't know what he means by Allah. Can you explain that to me or have him explain it to me? But he needs a smile. Okay. Uh, uh, so, uh, it is smile the first letter Arabic. Uh, this is the first letter of our Arabic, like A is the first letter of English language. The Arabic language, the first letter is Alif, and in Urdu as well. Okay, so how does that connect with the Quran? Explain that to me. Um, uh, may, may, may I tell you the Makhaj uh, of there will be two, two, two lips, uh, this lips and this lip. These both lips will, will touch. So um, the ba will, the ba will, this is the makhaj of the ba. Okay, so it's Aleph, Bet, Gimel, gim like it would be in Hebrew. Mem in Arabic it is ba. Mem in Arabic it is da and Urdu it is ba. Okay, tell me more. We, we have six alphabets uh, in English and we have as we have 20, 28 alf alphabets in Arabic. Uh, these are like Alif, Ba, Ta, Sa, Dim, Ha, Fa. Uh, these are some letters of uh, uh, first para. It is written in first para. The name of first para is Nurani Kaida. So it is, uh, and then and then um, we will come to another stage. It is first para. Uh, it is um, Alhamdulillah. The the uh, the 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 we call. Uh, when we start the Quran and the, then we read that Nurani Kaida because no, uh, we don't know that um, Alif Ba Ta Sajim Ha Ha. So it so it is um, it is uh, uh, it will make our uh, our 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 vocabulary strong. In uh, it is um, yeah some uh, men. And written it, uh, no, a man written that Nurani Kaida, uh, so he, uh, so, um, he drew up uh, parts of Quran, and, and there is um, 
and it's too much of lessons in Nurani Kaida. If you finish that Nurani Kaida, a Nurani Kaida is too much of easy when you go to first para as Alhamdulillah, so uh, it is la like tough. Wonderful. You really are a super kid. I know that I couldn't memorize the Quran like that. Um, Thank you, God. That is amazing. Ismail, this is show it to me. Is that the Quran you're memorizing? Or is that... Tell me a little more about it. Tell me about that book. Not yet. I'm here is reading Alibata Sa. Uh, it is really an in Rani Kaida. You can see this is in second uh, second uh, uh, Tukti wow. here. Here are sixteen Tukti. Hello, Mrs. Richman. How are you doing today? Hello. Hi, it's Mrs. Samir. It's yeah, hi. How are you doing today? No, you need to listen for a moment. First of all, how old are you? I'm 19. Okay, you look a little older and that's why I asked. I know that. I but know you, that. You need to let Ma Muhammad finish and then we'll give you a chance to talk. I'm more than okay. willing to listen to you, but give him okay. a chance, okay? Thank okay, you. okay. Okay, Muhammad, do you have anything else to say right now? Or should I go to say hello to Ismail? And I need you guys to speak with him because I'm still typing things in. Because I've been totally all over the place. Oh, I'm back now. So Okay. Uh so yeah. I am telling people how to get in too. I'm putting in those directions. So Hello? Nora, can you take over for a few minutes so I can finish doing this? Yeah. Uh, Hamdan, Hamdan, uh, you know, I love you. You are smiling, but you need to wait for your turn and we will unmute you and we will give you a chance to speak. Okay. So be patient and wait, please. Okay. Uh, I don't know where, where we were uh, when it's uh, like destruction is coming. So then we forgot the things where we were working. But anyhow, uh, okay, I, I'm totally lost. To <laughs> it's, it's happening. It's happening. It's not. It's not a big deal. So uh, who was next? Ismail was next, and I'm going to unmute him, and then we will uh, include all together so they can ask questions from each other uh, whenever they have. And, you know, so these conversations will go further. So I'm going to meet with Ismail and let him introduce himself. Ismail, oh, do, not, do not touch the unmute button. So let us do that, what we're doing, okay? Go on, brother. Yeah, hi, how's you all doing? Doing good. You're fine. Can I just make one announcement? As I type yes, in, please. people are asking me, call me, call me. We cannot do this. This is in Zoom. You need to download the Zoom app, just as I wrote in the chat. Get the Zoom app and then click on the link and it'll bring you to the show. But we are only allowed to <laughs> between 8 and 20 years old today. So if you're an adult, you're not coming in anyway. So, but you can prepare for tomorrow. Okay, back to you, Nor, or to Ismail. That and was Ismail. <laughs> name? Beg your pardon? How do I pronounce your name? Because I think I pronounced it incorrectly. Yes, you pronounce it uh, correctly. It's Ismail. Ismail, like smile. Yeah, like smile. Very good. So, what are you still a student and going to school? 
Yep, I'm a student. I'm going to college, not to school. Okay, and what are you studying in college? I'm doing my intermediate. I'm in mean, first year. Very good. Now, let me tell you something. I said school and you said college. In the yes. United States, when we talk about schools, we talk, we even college or university will say, are you going to school? And it's appropriate. I am happy okay. you corrected me because I needed to know that you're not a, you know, you're not a high school student. But just so you know, that is how we use the word, which is a little different from you, but it's okay. Okay, so tell me, where do you live? I live in Sahiwal, Pakistan. Oh. Sahiwal, Punjab, Pakistan. Great. Boy, like I was just... Go on. Like I was just scrolling down Facebook and I found the post to join the group chat. So I, would, I just like to test myself. Like I just want to have some chit chat with you all guys. That's why I joined it. Oh, is this the first time you've seen the show? Seen an yep. advertisement for the show? Yes, yes. I have, I have just installed the app. Where did you see it? Did you see it on Rehan Alawawa's page? Yep, yep. It was on my new page. It was on my Facebook new page. Okay. I have liked the page. Do you follow Rehan? Yep, I follow Rehan. They do have very useful material, very useful, helpful material for me. That's why. Well, I'm so happy you came. Thank you. Do you have anything that you want to do? What, why do you think learning English is very important? Like it's, a, it's an international language. I do have further plans to study abroad. That's why I always focus to learn English, to speak English with my friends. And I just, I'm just useful to do such kind of stuff. Very good. I'm glad you practice your English every day. Um, Abdullah or Samid, do you want to say something to Ismail? Yeah, Ismail, uh, this is a great thing that you're working on your English. Uh, if you're working on your English, to so work on your communication skills as well. Because if you have a great accent, if you have a great power of speaking, but communication skills count. Because if you want to speak confidently, so this counts. If you will come in this show on a daily basis, like Sunday to Sunday, then inshallah, we will help you to manage your communication skills greatly. Okay, thank you so much. Carla, I'll say congratulations. You had one of the great, great, great co-hosts for the show, for the youth show especially. I you know. know. <laughs> I am so yeah. proud of this young man. What about you, Sami? Do you want to say something about speaking English to Ismail or anything to Ismail? Yes, we must speak English. English, we can learn English um, by speaking English. We can learn any any kind of language by speaking. Uh, we, uh, if we do not speak, so we can do not learn uh, any kind of language. Correct. Very good. Thank you so very much. Ismail, and do you have anything else you want to say? I'm sorry. I don't think so. I don't think so. I just enjoy it a lot. Thank you. Oh, okay. That's it. <laughs> Nor, you wanted to say something? Uh, yeah, Hamdan is waiting for so long and waiting so patiently. So I'm going to unmute him and I would like to say welcome to Fiza. Uh, after a long effort, I invited her. So hopefully she is in the show right now. So over to you, Hamdan, and introduce yourself. Exactly what I was going to do. So we're on the same page. Yeah. Hi, Hamid. Exactly. My name is not Hamid. My name is Hamad. Hamad, sorry. Hamad, thank you for correcting me. That's so <laughs> important. 
That's probably the most important thing that you need to make me know. Thank you. How old are you, Muhammad? I am nine years old. Ah, and how did you find out about the show? Um, I don't find it. My mother did. I don't even know. How? Okay. How did you know? How do you know about the show? I don't. Someone help don't. me, Abdullah. Help me here. Help me. Yes. Yeah, still again, and I will try him to uh, to to tell him about. It. That. Help him understand that I want to know where he had found out about the show. Is he a friend of yours? Is he a friend of Samid? I don't know. Okay. On Facebook. Hamad, Hamad, uh, Carla is saying that from where you get our uh, this link uh, to join Zoom. So she's asking, are you a friend of me or Samid or Nurbai? Can you tell this? Or even I, following Rayhan. Uh, and I'm just linking the show on Facebook and I'm nobody's friend on here, so I don't know anybody on the show. <laughs> what a great answer. <laughs> <laughs> Do you follow Rayhan Awawawa? <laughs> But I don't have that. Are you following Rayhan Awawawa? No, I don't know that. I don't know uh, him. I, I do. I do. Yeah. Okay. Um, Hamdan, your, your mom is giving you instructions from behind, and we don't need that. You need to speak by your own. So that's the only way we can address you. Uh, so okay. ask her, please don't give you instructions. Uh, you know, you need your fundamental rights to speak by your own. So that will help you. Okay. Am I right, Carla? Yep. Thank you. I would have said that myself. I just didn't. <laughs> okay. Uh, there is two person in attendee room, uh, Jazaba and Khawar Saeed. We need your age. Uh, I also yes, wrote it you in the Jazaba. chat. So uh, it's Jazaba or Jazaba, I don't know. Um, yeah, I know Okay. Uh, Kala, we have Fiza, and so uh, she already unmuted by her own self, and let her introduce his, uh, herself. Okay, yes. does Hamid want to say anything else? Hamid, let me yes. explain, and I'll explain this to your mom, too, at the same time. Okay. Hamid needs to learn to speak on his own. If mom does it for him and tells him what to say, it's not going to help him. It's okay to make mistakes, but he needs to do it. And maybe Abdullah can give him a little motivation about this. Abdullah? I'd love to. Okay, uh, Hamad, it's a very simple technique. Don't be afraid of anyone. Allah Ta'ala didn't make any of your comparative or anyone who can compare you with anyone. Okay, so be relaxed. If you speak in a, a wrong language, like you're not speaking English correctly, so I will manage, I will help you. And everyone is here, like me, uh, Muhammad Samid, Nurullah, Bhaiya, and Karla, are here to help you. So be relaxed, inshallah. Do you know any kind of help from me? Just text me. I will tell you how to speak in English. And inshallah, I will work with you because I love to work with the youth. And you are the youth of, of this world. And one, one suggestion for you, Abdullah, brother, you need to uh, reduce your speed. You are going to speak so fastly. It's hard for a participant yeah. to understand you. So yeah. make sure when you make conversation with someone, uh, you need to go with the limit. If you're going like the way you're going, so might be these people not get you what you are talking about. So there's also um, an easy way to make a conversation with someone. Anyhow, so let's get to Fiza Khan. Over to you. 
And also, Samid, what would you like to tell Hamid about speaking English? Say it slowly. Don't, You're doing a great job today. I, I don't shy from anyone because we all are brother and sister, um, and uh, we all are Muslims. And, uh, we all are brothers, sisters. We all are uh, like friendly with us. With uh, all of the people, all, uh, all uh, uh, we, uh, you can uh, ask for, uh, from me for the help for Abdullah by Kanti or uh, Nurullah. Uh, so we will correct your mistake. Uh, do not take uh, uh, help of someone. Uh, speak with uh, your own self. Uh, what is on your mind? So speak. Okay, so are you guys always be there in this program every day? I watch it. I watch it. I am here every day, and so is Noor. Abdullah and Samid are only here on Sunday when we do the show for eight to 20 year olds. But you can come to the show any day, and they can come to the show any day. But today is primarily for young people. Tala, we have two beautiful young ladies in the queue I as well. Oh, <laughs> I don't want to just leave Hamid. But Hamid, I'm going to speak to Jazaba or Fiza. Fiza is back. first and then Jazaba. Okay, uh, okay. Fiza, but Fiza disappeared. There huh? she is, yay! <laughs> Hi, Fiza. Where are you from? Uh, I'm in a room. I live in Karachi. Ah. And where did you find the show? Yes. Where did you find out about the show? Help me, Abdullah or Sameed. Okay. <clears throat> Fiza, she is just saying a simple thing. To, uh, be relaxed. She's saying from where you get the idea, from where you saw this uh, this video running. So uh, in my page or in Rihan Alawala's page, anyone in this group, uh, the, the way you get this video, like anyone's ID, anyone's account, anyone's, anyone uh, share you the thing. Just a simple question. Be relaxed with it. Okay, let me help. Let me help. Uh, Fiza, <laughs> Carla, Carla is asking. Carla is asking. How did you join the show? Where did you find the show? I find the Play Store. This show. Mm -hmm. So I download it. Because okay. I speak language class, I trying. Okay. Speaking well. Yeah. Uh, Kala, she's the one that I help her to bring her in. You know. To oh, some... okay. Yeah. Oh, I'm so glad you came. Yeah. Okay. Um, Fiza, can you tell us can in you? which in which class you study? I study. I study in class five. Okay, and what is your favorite subject? My favorite subject is science. Uh -huh. And uh, why is science is your favorite subject? What's make you happy to study science? Science is, so, science is so easy and I love science because science has us, I, um, I become scientist because science is so easy. Okay, great. Um, you know, I'm so happy today. We have wonderful, wonderful kids today in the show, Carla, and everyone is speaking very good. Yeah, uh, I'm thrilled myself. That's a good. Um, Zakria, you we need your age, and people who are saying, "Call me, call me," you need to get the Zoom app and come to the show. We cannot call you. This is not a regular Facebook Live. I am so very sorry. 
Okay. <clears throat> okay, Fiza. Yes. You like science. What area of science do you like the most? G. What do you really like studying in science? I am. What is your favorite area in science? My favorite science? Yes. Like, uh, you like like biology, zoology, there are as many books in the science. So Bio which one is, which one is your favorite? Biology. Biology, why do you like biology? Uh, all my sisters, my brothers loves biology, so I love the biology. Oh, that's great. I'm so happy to hear that. And what? how many how many siblings you have, Fiza? How many brother or sister you have? Uh, I have uh, three, four brothers okay. and uh, two sisters. Great. Two brothers, my cousin. Ah, uh, your cousins, included cousins, that's good. You're always including cousins, you know, in, in the siblings. That's a good idea. Anyway, um, Jazba or Jazaba, I couldn't pronounce that name correctly. Sorry for that. So yes. I'm admitting, I'm admitting you as well. And you introduce yourself. Uh, Assalamu alaikum. Okay. My name is Jazba Rahil, and I'm a blog poster. Uh-huh. Kala, did you want to say something? I do want to say something just to the audience and also to people who are here. Mm -hmm. um, we're here to help everyone in English, but we need to give everyone a turn. And if you want to come, you need to download the Zoom app to come in. Um, Hamid Khan, I know you want to speak again. I'll find some time before the end of the show so you can speak. Your mom is excited about you speaking. I'll make sure that there's a little time. And people waiting to come in, we need to know how old you are before we can bring you in today. Okay. Uh, I am nine years old, and I also <laughs> love science. <laughs> That's great. You probably can become a friend of Jasaba because she loves science. And She's a black poster. That was Fiza Carla. What? Oh, I got them confused. I am so yeah. sorry. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so um, any questions from Jasaba? She's a black poster. Uh, Jasaba, can can you? Uh, tell a little bit about that. What is block poster? Uh, if I hear correctly. Uh, we can post their contents and educate people. Uh, what kind of contents? Can you elaborate, please? Uh, like Islamic stories and mm -hmm. knowledgeable things. Uh -huh. Okay, that's great. So, Carla, uh, can I ask any question for you? Yes, who's asking? What's your favorite subject? <laughs> to be honest, it is art. I love to draw, I love to paint, and I love to take pictures. Okay. Let's ask um, Samid. What's your favorite subject, Samid? My favorite subject, subject is mathematics. Uh, I hate no. math. <laughs> Sorry, mom. I'm, I'm impressed that you love math. Amina and Faisal, we need your age, and then we can bring you in. Until then, we can't. Um, Abdullah, what's your favorite subject? Samir just told my favorite subject as well. My favorite subject is mathematics. You're kidding. <laughs> Oy, yes. I just love algebra and algebraic rules, the formulas, the expressions, and matrices. Awesome. Maybe um, you can teach me math because I don't like it. 
Um, Hamid, what is your favorite subject? My subject is science. And Abdullah, can you teach me some maths, please? Because I love maths, but I'm not good at it. <laughs> Just get the book and the register with a pen. I will teach you everything. Okay. okay. Uh, I have. You guys become friends on Facebook, and then you can do that. That would be great. Um, oh. Carla, I have a question for Hamad Khan, and before that, I appreciate Afiza. She is the first ever kids who ask question from Carla. That's that's very good. And uh, Abd Hamad, where, when you, yes. the way you're speaking, so where did you learn that English? Uh, are your parents helping you? Are you learning in the schools? I, le I learned a lot of English in the school, and every time I speak English, I get most of the badges in my class. Oh, Yay! very nice. And I'm so glad you're feeling more confident. Samid, where's your smile? <laughs> Yay, there it is. Hey, Samid, what made you so good in English? Uh, because I speak English. I speak with I speak English with my um past, so um, that's why my English is good. Very good, Amina and Faisal. We will not bring you in until you tell us your age. There's no question about it. You just don't raise your hand. Just tell us how old you are. Thank you. Okay, Jazaba, what made you want to learn to speak English? My parents helped me to speak English. Okay, did you learn do you learn in school too? Yes. And where do you live, Jazaba? Uh, in Lahore. You live in Lahore. I hear it's a beautiful city. Yes. Very nice. And oh, I forgot your name, Fiza. Yes. Where do you live? I live in Karachi. Okay. And where do you go to school? G? Yes. Where do you go to school? Uh, I st my school name is Kalyana Academy. Okay, and what are you? What do you study the most in school? What? What do you study the most in school? Um, English. Ah, why did you pick English? Wait a minute, there's two Samids here now. No, ma'am, he's my little brother. His name is Shahid. Hi, you look alike. Hi, Shahid. They look twins, Carla. <laughs> that was what. I when he sat down, that's what I saw. Let me get back to Fiza. I'm all over the place today. Mm -hmm. Okay, Fiza, tell me about yourself. Oh, <laughs> I did in class two. Okay. What class are you in? What class are you in, Fiza? Yes. What class are you in? I study in class five. Ah, so, okay. And tell me about your school. What do you like most in school? 
I like uh, Beacon House and uh, Metropolitan. Okay. These are my favorite schools. Okay. What else? Um, what, when do you wake up to go to school? What? When, when do you get up to go to school? 5 p.m. 5 a.m. 5 a.m. When do you go into school? That sounds really early for a child. What time do you go to school? 6, 7 p.m. 7 p.m. or 7 a.m.? You mean 7 in the morning? 7 a.m. Sorry, sorry, sorry. It's my okay. mistake. You really speak very well. Yep. Amina, Inam, are you a girl? Because otherwise you really need to have your camera on. Carla, we... yes. uh, sorry to interrupt. Amina must be a girl. It's a Pakistani name. So, uh... oh, okay. I didn't know. I got an all the names confused. Yeah. And how old is Amina? According to her, 10 years. So let's unmute her and let's talk with her. Hi, Amina. Hello. My camera is not working now. OK, that's fine. You're a girl, right? I am a boy. No, I am a boy. Yes, yeah. boy. Okay. Oh, say anyway. How old this is This is my mother's ID. Oh, OK. It's okay. Today you can stay. <laughs> what is your favorite subject in school? My favorite subject is English. I can't believe everyone likes to learn English. This is really good. Where did you find the show so you could come today? Sorry, what are you saying? Where did you find the show? Uh, from Facebook. Okay. Do you want to help me, Samid or Abdullah? Where's your smile? Hey, don't be serious, man. Samid and Shahid. <laughs> love, love, love. You should tickle each other. I'll tickle you if you don't. I am Abdullah. I am 10 years old. I am from Lahore, Pakistan. Ah, I think Jasma is from Lahore, right? Jasma. Are you from Lahore? Yes. Yeah. You have a new friend. And um, she's my sister. No, he, she is a he. <laughs> How old is your sister, Jasima? How old are you? My sister is six years old. Wow. Hi. What's her name? My name is Rania. What is it? <laughs> My name is Rania. Rania. Hi. So me, do you want to ask anyone any questions? Maybe ask Amina a question. Yes. Uh, uh, does she a good or why? Because uh, her, her name is another thing, and uh, he or she is saying another name. Her name is really Amina, and she, uh, he, he or she is saying another name. OK. Ask her. Or him? Yes. 
Ask him if he's a boy or a girl. How old are you? I'm six years old. In 2019, 2019 in 12 January, I am a What? <laughs> Abdullah, do you have something to say? And then I'll talk to Amina. I just wanted to say that, uh, ask he or she, that he or she is a human being. <laughs> I think so. <laughs> We have human beings at the show today. Good question. But uh, Amina, what what's the his uh, her boy name? I don't know. It's, I think Abdullah. Uh, he was asking you questions, Kala. How old are you? I'm not gonna say what what Samir is saying to you. You know. <laughs> how old do you think I am? It's going to put me into trouble. So <laughs> oh, yeah, I know that. How old do you think I am? I'm not mentioning your name, Carla, on live streams. You know, you will shoot me. And I don't want to die right now. <laughs> I want to do it on camera. <laughs> <laughs> They come after me, and then the United States government will come Tyler. after me. No, not on camera. Tyler, I ask and one question for you. What? Where do you live? I live in Washington, D.C. area. Okay. Jasba want to say something, okay? I have a question for Ab Abdullah Bhai. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, who, is your, who is your inspiration, Abdullah Bhai? Yeah, uh, my inspiration is uh, the great Qaeda Azam Muhammad Ali Jinnah, our founder. And being a Muslim, my inspiration okay. is the Prophet Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam as well. Mara just put in a wonderful answer to, to that question. 20 years, 29 years old with a few years experience. Thank you. And again, we cannot call anyone. You need to download the Zoom app to come. If you're older than 20 years old, you need to come tomorrow. I'm sorry. <laughs> I, 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 read, uh, I read the comments, Carla. They're quite funny today. <laughs> <laughs> We should get this during the week like this. I do love it. <laughs> I love that. But um, okay, we have uh, like last three minutes, and I want to say um, all those young boys and girls, thank you for coming. Thank you for joining. Um, English is a universal language, and we everyone need to learn it. You know, to make a good, good conversations, to explore our society, culture, and religions. It's also important to understand each other, but that we need to learn this universal language. I appreciate that your parents doing a great effort that they bring you in the show. They give you a fundamental rights to speak. Uh, I'm so happy and uh, my salute to those parents who are doing efforts uh, with them kids and they bring them children in the show and they are uh, showing them ability. Yeah, my child can do so everyone child can do. So thank you very much guys for joining. And, uh, okay, Carla. Can I add oh, something? You. I'm still willing to bring people in. I'm wow. having fun. But Please, wait. Don't go. Someone is asking that we should ask the kids about world peace. I can do it, but I'm not going to do it today because it will be a longer show and I do need to get off soon. But that is a very good question, Michelle. And I think we did it last week or the week before, but I feel very strongly about it. Could you come to the show tomorrow and we could talk about it with anyone who comes? 
I would love to talk about that subject. Now, um, we should have another show like this next week. There's a gentleman, Shakur. What's your question? Take her. One moment. You can come to the show any day, Monday through Thursday at 9 p.m. same time, but it's a general show and it's open to the pub to anyone then. And I would lo love to hear what you have to say. So please feel free to come. I know that you said you speak English with non-English speakers. We could learn from each other. Hello. Yes, who wanted to ask a question? Someone's saying hello. I don't know who it is. Was it Amina? I think so. I mean, what do you want to say? I cannot hear you really. Oh, you don't have a good internet connection. We will need to deal with that later, not today, okay? Come to okay. tomorrow or next Sunday and we can deal with that then. There are two people in the waiting room and unfortunately we don't know your age, but it is about time to close the show. If you tell us your ages, maybe I'll consider bringing you in and letting you say hi, but we only have about another 10, 15 minutes at most. Because I have to make sure that my new co-hosts, Samid and Abdullah, get to bed on time. They go to school yes. tomorrow, I think. And Samid is losing his smile. Yes, Hamad, what do you want to say? Yes, that Antia is done tomorrow. Oh, great! I would love to have you here tomorrow. That would be so much fun. Yes. Thank, hello? thank you. Yes, someone's saying hello. Who's saying hello? Mohammed, what do you want to say? Can, can we have a show every day like Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, yeah. Saturday, Sunday? Not Saturday, not Friday and Saturday, but you can come any day, any other okay. day. Okay. But I have this show for kids, so I get to let kids feel comfortable about coming. Okay. So that's what this is about. That's why I do it. Mm -hmm. And it started for a few kids who never show up. <laughs> you know, I don't quite get it, but it's okay. Okay, uh, if you are Let's expanding time, Carla, let me be relaxed. Before, before we do it, I want everyone to get a chance to say one last thing before we close out. And we're um, going to start with Amina Inam. Do you have anything to say? I'm very thankful to you to invite me. You to invite me and along with uh, Abdullah Salim Bhai, uh, I'm very happy to uh, uh, in this show. Uh, I've, I've really enjoyed the show. And I am so happy to have you. Thank you for coming. Welcome. Yeah, we're thrilled to have you. Does anyone else want to say any last words before I shut down the show? And Thank you. At me? <laughs> well, I don't have anything, Kala. I already uh, said that before. But again, I, was, I would like to say thanks to everyone who was watching and who joining the show. Uh, oh, please. Noor, uh, Jasabha wants to say something. Thank you, ma'am, Sarna, for your precious time. Thank you for coming. I'm so glad. And please come again.
The kids can come any day. Yes, oh, yes I was so on your fantastic. I want you to come. Visa, did you want to say something? What? Did you have anything you wanted to say? Yes. What? Um, um you help help me well improve my English and I I and I want to learn even more English with you, so this is a good show. Well, come again, and you can come any day, but Sunday is really for you guys, okay? Okay. Want to come Monday through Thursday? You're more than welcome to come. Okay, any, Hamid, you had your hand up. What did you want to say? I just said it already. Oh, you okay. know, Carla, Hamid answered behalf of Fida, and Fida is quiet. I mean, Fiza, not Fida, sorry. Okay. Abdullah. Oh, Fiza. Do you, whoa, wait a moment. Abdullah, do you have Hello? anything to say? Yeah, I want to say that, that inshallah, inshallah, me and Carla and Nubai will be with you on Sunday. So join us and I will share this video more and more and more. So every young person can come in our show and he will make his... English even more better, inshallah. Yay, thank you. I love that idea. And for the people out there, this show is a conversation in English. We help people speak English better, but it's not to teach English, it's to give that confidence for the people, for anyone to just speak it. You don't need to be the best, the most experienced in speaking English, whether you're eight years old or a hundred, you just need to come in and speak. You guys are reading and writing English. This show gives you that chance to speak it and to give you that experience. And I don't care about your mistakes. I just care that you come in and you begin speaking. It will improve and I'll help you improve, but I will not do it the first time you come. It's more important that you come, you speak, and you enjoy, begin to enjoy speaking. Now, we're going to have Noor put a smile on his face because I'm going to get ready to say goodbye. Everyone, Bye -bye. thank you so much for coming. Thank you, Abdullah. Thank you, Samid and brother. Thank you, Fiza. Thank you, Hamid. Thank you, Jazaba. I don't know if I got your name correct. And thank you, Abdullah Inam. And anyone else who, thank you. who may have left, Thank you so much. I am so happy to see you. So happy to speak English with you. And feel free to come and see me anytime. That's what this show is about. It's about having you here and having you be able to talk. And like tomorrow, people who are older than 20, you can come too. Okay? So we're going to wave goodbye. Nor you've been waiting for me to do this. Nor we're waving goodbye, and we'll be back tomorrow Bye. at nine o'clock p.m. But Bye. next Sunday okay. we'll have Nor, Abdullah, and Sami with me for sure, and anyone else who wants to come. Bye. Uh, <clears throat> Bye. Did you want to say something, Nor? Okay. Um...